I'm sorry it's raining, but I want you all to. Get, does anybody grow strawberries? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> does anybody have strawberries on the ground now that look like these? No. No way. <laughs> well, let me tell you why. Whoa, this is I huge. <laughs> <laughs> Look at the color of the foliage this time of year. Right. And if someone wants a real treat, take a bite of this um, fennel while I'm talking to you. You're going to be shocked at the flavor. It's delicious. Strawberries are a labor-intensive plant to grow. Right. You send these runners out, and when you first plant your bed, they produce well, and then over time they get really dense because they can't... And it's a nightmare to get the old ones out because they're covered by young ones. So you're in there thinning, and it's just a ton of work. So I'm out with God. Say, so, you know, God, you says your yoke is easy, your bird is light. This is not. How would you approach it? He says, every fall, cover the whole strawberry bed with witches. Just bury it. What? Bury the whole strawberry bed with witches. Just cover the whole thing. Bury it. Hide it. And here's the beauty and the genius of God. See, it doesn't take, doesn't take a lot either, because watch this. See how it just lays down? So it doesn't take much to cover. So when I put the wood chips over this, all these leaves under the wood chips become compost and feed the plants. And here's the genius of God. In the spring, out of the ground, you don't even know it's there anymore, come pushing through the wood chips, totally staggered, just the young, healthy plants. The old ones under the wood chips rot and become compost yeah, because they can't push through the wood chips. It's too much work. <laughs> and if you look at these, these are all young plants. Now this man, I want you to walk. Just walk on top of my, my strawberries like they're... Just walk on them. Hard. <laughs> Step hard. I mean, it's hard. Go for it. Ha <laughs> you see? That's he's, hard. He's having no impact. Nothing's getting broken because under the wood chips, it's all buoyant, full of air, and nothing's damaged. You're I mean, I'm six huh? inches deep right and here. It's soft. Every fall? Every fall. Around I would do it... Pretty soon. Pretty soon. I'm here? leaving this here because it looks so good just for these tours. <laughs> uh. <laughs> and, and I want you to notice over here, you see my strawberries over there? You notice I'm growing strawberries under my trees in shade. The book says plant in full sun. <laughs> right. Are you starting to they get the event? You see, them. all your places that you couldn't use under the wood chips are available. So instead of taking up space, you can grow other stuff. Plant under your trees strawberries. Great ground cover. I have no weeds. I never water. It's always a pleasure to look at. Feeds you well. And you can do it in places where they say you can't. Do you fully bury them every year? Every year. And that's why they're all young plants. You see, there's no old right. ones here. Because right. the old ones became compost under the wood chips. And I didn't have to thin. I'm thinking it takes 20 minutes compared to hours of thinning. Uh, <laughs> that, where I'm, is that documented? <laughs> can I tell you something? You will never find this in a book. Right. No human mind will come up with this. This came from the Creator. I asked. And <laughs> come on, he's just awesome. And he says you have not because you asked that. You don't ask. And we've got to wake up and start doing it. Is there any special time of day or night that you ask? I, I do. <laughs> I do. There, there's no time I don't anymore. All day long, I'm just out. out we're talking all the time. This is God. Well, look over here. You don't just ask him. you got to listen all also. Huh? Yeah. Oh, you're so welcome. But look, look at how beautiful this is. Well, just enough to bury it. Just to get it out of sight. And then all winter long, you can walk on it. You don't notice there's... Because your strawberries in winter are ugly looking. They're all you know, dark, ugly leaves, funky. You don't even see them. And then in the spring, it's just so exciting. Like, they come pushing. Wow, the strawberries are coming. And then they... You, I wish you were here when they were ripe. They're just so huge and so delicious. Like... And then I have no weeds, and I've never watered this. Oh and you want to hear something awesome? <laughs> this bed here, and I've given boxes to people because they grow so well, was three plants four years ago. Oh. Yes. And I've given boxes because they keep sending runners out taking my path.